hey, if you're buying tools and plugins and different extensions all in the hopes of being able to spy on your competitors, Facebook ads, I'm here to tell you to stop doing it because I'm going to show you how you can do that for free. Stay right there. Hey, what's going on? This is Mike with BrandTheBoss.com and in today's video, we're going over how to spy on your competitors' Facebook ads. So, if this is the kind of content that you like, please hit that subscribe button. And at any point during this video, if you enjoy it, please hit that thumbs up. So, let's go ahead and jump into this. All right, so, like I said before, you don't need any fancy tools or any uh, plugins or extensions. Facebook is going to provide you your competitors ads for free. So all you have to do is go to the Facebook ad library and to get there, just stick it in Google and then you're going to want to click onto this link. All right, so once you're here, this is the Facebook ad library. So if you already know who your competition is and you've seen their ads already on Facebook, all you have to do is look it up. So for example, what I'm gonna do is, is I'm gonna look for Russell Brunson. He's always running ads. So since he's in my recent searches, he just pulls right on up. So. This is basically the profile right here. So when you find your competitor, you can just have a take, take a look at this. And you can see right here with Russell, you can see all his active ads right now. And it might even show his inactive ones, but take a look at all of this right here. See all the ads. So you can find all your competitors ads right here. So what you wanna do is when you actually find your competitor's ads, oh, and it tells you the ad spend that, they are, that they're doing. Um, basically, if their ads fall into the category of uh, social issues, elections, or politics, which is a pretty broad issue, but yeah. So when you actually find your competitor's ads, this is what you wanna go ahead and do. You wanna study their ads real quick. You wanna look at the description. What is it that they're talking about? Cause this is how you want to actually go ahead about go ahead and um, model uh, your ads after. So you want to see what's actually working for them. So for example, right here, we'll take a look at this one in the middle. Um, what you want to do is you can actually take a look at the details of the ad itself. And then model it right here. See where it's pointing to. And then you can click the button, learn more, and see where that takes you to as well. So let's actually see where that goes. Okay, so it goes to the Expert Secrets landing page. So what you wanna go ahead and do is, for example, if you are doing an ad that is similar to what Russell's doing, then you want to go ahead and funnel hack him as well. So you want to go ahead and actually have a look at your competitors ads right here, just like this, and uh, maybe build your funnel or your website similar to the way that they're actually doing it as well. So I'm not going to go over his entire um, landing page, but you get the idea. So you want to go ahead and study the ad, look at the copy, Look at what look at the photo or the video that they're using and do something similar. And then have a look at where they're actually taking you to. If it's a landing page, maybe you want to actually model your landing page uh, in a similar way, because if it's working for them, it can work for you. So this um, isn't on, only good for just looking at individuals. You can actually look at different uh, companies as well. So I'm going to go to a different example right here. So this company right here is called 33 Mile Radius. 
and they do local lead generation in uh, different uh, industries such as like plumbing and um, water damage and mold and things like that. So if you're in a local lead generation niche and that's your business, then guess what? You can go ahead and have a look at the type of advertisement that they are doing. So we'll take a look at, let's have a look at this one right here. So you can see right here, they have a big, they have a, some emojis and attention plumbers. And you can look at the different copy that they use as well. And you can also model um, your photo to something similar as well. If you're also providing uh, leads to uh, local businesses. And let's see if we got one that will show us where it will lead to. So for example, right here, just learn more. Let's take a look at where it takes us. It looks like it takes us to their plumbing page on their website. So if you have a website that's advertising for uh, lead generation, then you could possibly um, build out a a page on your website or a landing page similar to what they have showing the type same type of information and things like that you know so it's really it's really pretty easy to see your competitors um uh, advertisements on facebook i mean all you have to do is just come here to the ads library and all of it's here for you like everything if they're if they're active it'll even show you if they're inactive as well if they're ads that they're no longer running so it's that simple. So don't waste your time and your money on um, plugins, extensions, and tools that people are trying to sell you so you can look at your uh, Facebook competitors' uh, ads. Just come to the Facebook ads library. All they did was move it over to here, and it gives you so much more information. So if you like this video, go ahead and give this a thumbs up. And uh, if this is the type of content that you like, man, go ahead and shoot, shoot something in the comment section. And let me know that you like this. And if you have any ideas for anything else that you would like me to talk about, go ahead and put that down there as well. Other than that, I'm Mike with BrandonBoss.com. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Take care.